Hello viewers, welcome back. So this is the 18th video as part of our series of video on power of reporting of Tally Prime. So in this video, we will see a couple of more reports under accounts book and see what other techniques that we can apply to completely leverage the power of these reports. So let us go to Tally and explore these options of reporting under accounts book. To analyze a ledger's transaction, normally you would drill down from financial statements of balance sheet or profit and loss account. Now for focused analysis of any ledger, you can actually use ledger report. There are two ways of analyzing a selective ledger. The navigation path would be from the gateway of tally, click on display more report and from display more report click on accounts book and now we have ledgers so we will get the list of ledger the easy way is from the gateway of tally click on go to and type ledger vouchers come down and select ledger vouchers and we will get the same list of ledgers here you can select your desired ledger for focused analysis let me select the ledger amar enterprises if you notice by default tally will show vouchers for the current month now to view for the entire year click on f2 period and just press spacebar in the from field press enter and press spacebar again and press enter now you will view the transactions detail for the entire year with the help of right side button bar and f12 configure you can view the details of the ledger with different data analysis techniques. So that is what we will see now. Let us start with F12 configure. Now to view this transaction with the details of bill wise, inventory detail and payment detail, you can press F12 configure and in the format of report, come down and select as detail. The next option show bill wise, just press Y inventory detail press y mode of payment press y and the additional bank detail option will get enabled again press y here and save it by pressing ctrl a now we are able to view each transaction with the details of inventory and also the bill wise detail now to collapse this detail all you have to do is your cursor is here on as per detail of sales just press shift enter now the detail will get collapsed similarly for the bank receipt detail voucher we have this bank detail again press shift enter and it will collapse instead of repeating this step for all the voucher again you can press f12 configure and come here and click on condensed and press ctrl a now all the information will be condensed information. If you want to view the ledger details with a running balance, again, you can press F12 configure. And here at the bottom, you will see the option show running balance. Come down here, click here and press Y, enter and control A to save. Now we can view the detail of the transaction with the running balance let us now explore the technique of a right side button bar we are viewing the ledger detail if you want to view the bill wise detail very simple all you have to do is come to the right hand side button bar and click on bill wise now tally is going to give you the bill wise outstanding of the selected ledger escape and come back to the ledger another easy technique to analyze the party detail with all the information is columnar. So how do we view columnar information of this party? Again, on the right hand side button bar, we have this option called columnar. Click on columnar and you can enable additional information as per your requirement. Let us make sure that you set this option show quantity detail to yes, show rate detail yes and show item value yes. Once these options are set to S, all you have to do is press Ctrl A. Now you will see the detail of sales for the entire year and also the receipt information 
in the columnar report. Now to view the item detail and the item rate, press Alt 5 for detail. You will now see each item, quantity, rate and the gross value, sale amount, tax amount and the bank detail also. Now if you want to view the same detail for any other party master, all you have to do is again remember the right hand side button bar, you have this button called F4 ledger click on ledger tally will now give you the list of ledger for you to select your desired ledger let me select ambika enterprises enter and now we will see the columnar detail of ambika enterprises it is that simple for you to quickly switch between the ledgers without repeatedly configuring for each ledgers now to come back to the voucher report do not press escape come to the right side button bar click on this blue arrow under columnar button click here and we have this option called vouchers the keyboard shortcut is Control f8 or you click on vouchers and we will come back to the voucher detail another handy option that you have is on the right side button bar you have this button called contact the keyboard shortcut is alt s click on contact and if you have specified the contact detail in the ledger master then you will get this information which will help you to quickly contact the party if required the next important analysis is that if you want to know what are the items that you have sold to the party for the given period or for the entire year in this case you can view so by clicking on change view click on change view and from the list of view select moment analysis click on moment analysis and now we will get the list of all the items that we have sold to armor enterprises for the entire year let us take another use case let's say you want to analyze ledgers of a particular group say indirect expenses group you can do so by going to the group summary what we are viewing is individual ledger now let us view the ledgers of a particular group again click on go to and just type group summary and select group summary you will get the list of groups under the list of group let us select indirect expenses and now we are viewing the ledgers under the group indirect expenses and the closing balance as on date the next analysis that you would want to conduct is let us say you want to view percentage of expenses against the total expenses of indirect expenses for the year. So how do we view that? Press F12 configure and we have this option called show percentage. Click here and press Y to add and now you can save this. Now we can see the expenses percentage for each of your expenses against the total expenses so if 19,93,373 is 100% of your indirect expenses what is the constituent expense for each of the ledger so if you take advertisement expenses the company is spend 6.02% towards advertisement expenses now if you see what is the major expenses for the year the major expenses for the year is salaries which is 39.1 one three percent the next analysis that you would want to do is you want to now break up this analysis on a quarterly basis and compare the percentage of expenses over your total expenses for each of the quarter so how do we do that on the right side button bar you have this button called auto column click on auto column and in the auto column let us select quarterly you can view based on the different periodicity that tally provides let us select quarterly so select quarterly and show total column yes we will say yes enter now we are viewing the quarterly indirect expenses and also we are seeing the total expenses for the year as we are analyzing the expenses we can further refine this report for better analysis or study so what do we do click on f12 configure and here set this option show transaction to yes and select 
net transaction only to yes and let us say you don't want to see the closing balance say no to closing balance and now press control a so now we are viewing the net transaction of each expenses percentage wise against the total expenses and also we are now able to view quarterly expenses breakup and their quarterly percentage to convert this to yearly again click on auto column and now select yearly and we don't need total column just say no and we are back in the yearly report here if you want to see the voucher listing we know that you can select a particular ledger enter it is going to give you monthly analysis select a particular month enter and we are going to get the list of voucher here we are able to view only the vouchers listing of a selected voucher now let us say that you want to view the list of all the vouchers of indirect expenses for any given period so how can we do that there is a way click on go to and now type group vouchers and select group vouchers again from the list of group let us select indirect expenses now here for the month of march tally is now listing the vouchers of all your expenses that you have transacted for the month of march let us take the first transaction payment voucher number 120 it's already selected just press enter and you will notice that this transaction is towards expenses of office rent and maintenance charges now to go to the next voucher you have a keyboard shortcut which is press page down it will take you to the next voucher and this voucher is towards advertisement expenses page down this is towards printing and stationery page down communication expenses just press escape so this way if you want to view the list of vouchers for all the ledgers under any selected particular group you can use group voucher to view them i hope you would have got the understanding of how you can leverage the reporting of ledger how you can change the ledger from within a ledger and also we saw the other techniques with the right side button bar and the f12 configuration and in most important we also understood the difference between group summary and group vouchers so this is going to be very useful especially for auditors or for senior members of the organization to quickly check all the transactions related to a particular group rather than going to individual ledger and then reviewing the transactions so thank you all once again for staying till the end see you all in the next session Thank you very much.